This is my everyday carry. I fluctuated quite a bit over the years. Sometimes I've carried more, sometimes I've carried less, but this is currently what I'm carrying and I'm pretty happy with this so far. My name is Chris, founder of Lockbee, and this is my EDC. Okay, so let's start with a pocket knife. This is the Civivi Elementum and it's very slim, has a flipper, so easy to deploy. It's got a deep carry pocket clip, which I like, disappears in the pocket, very slim. And I went with the micarta scales. I like it because it reminds me of wax canvas. Obviously I have a lot of wax canvas in my EDC collection and um, it kind of develops a patina over time in the same way. You could see where the hand oils kind of stain it a little bit more in some places versus others. And I like that, it gives a little bit of character. For a multi-tool, I went with a pretty minimalist option. This is the Gerber Armbar Slim Drive. And so it really only has two tools. You've got the screwdriver with two bits, Phillips and flat on one side and then on the other side you have another blade which comes out of the box pretty sharp. I do have a larger multi-tool in my vehicle kit. It's definitely more capable so for my EDC I really don't need much and I find that this is just enough for me. Um, I do tend to use that screwdriver quite a bit because I tinker once in a while. But for my vehicle kit, I'll have a link up here when that's up and ready to go. All right and then I put that in the front pocket of my pocket journal. So this is the Lock B pocket journal. We make it out of wax canvas. Lately, I've been carrying the black around. We also have this available in brown and navy, but I carry my fountain pen with me, my Gerber multi-tool with me, and then on the inside here, I just have the plain refill. I do have another video about my other pocket journal, which I use as my workout journal, and I'll put a link up here if you wanna see that. But for my everyday carry, I usually use just the plain refill. I kinda like the freedom of having nothing on the pages. I do usually carry a fountain pen. We use Tomoe River paper, which is, in my opinion, the best fountain pen paper out there, which is why we chose it. Some people actually use their Lockbee pocket journal as the their wallet because we do have card sleeves on the inside so you could put business cards credit cards that sort of thing um, I actually do have a separate wallet but I'll get to that later so this is the Lockbee pocket journal and then in the front pocket I carry various fountain pens I kind of rotate through my collection but most recently I've been using the Lamy 2000 and this is in a fine nib. I just find you can't go wrong with the Lamy 2000. It's a solid rider, super smooth, great ink capacity. And I just love it for everyday carry. Inside I have SBRE Brown ink and shout out to Dr. Steven Brown. When I first started learning about fountain pens years ago, I learned a lot from his channel. So many thanks to him. Okay, of course I got my keys. You wanna be careful when showing your keys on social media, of course, because you can make copies from the stills. So I'll be blurring that out. For a phone, I just have an iPhone. I think this is the 13 and it does its job. Okay, so for the wallet, this is by Montbell and it's a really slim option. I don't carry a lot of cash with me typically. I just have some IDs, credit cards, really slim, fits in my front pocket. One thing I do like about this, it has a front zipper here that I can put coins in. So, you know, when I do use cash, once in a while I have coins. So it's nice to have that little coin pocket as well. Okay, so my watch. I've always been a fan of mechanical watches. Uh, my first watch was actually a Seiko 5, and I still think it's a really great watch, especially for the price, you can't beat it. This is my first and only fancy watch. This is a Rolex Datejust 41. I wear it every day, I love it. It's one of those things I splurged on when I started making money in the business. And last but not least, I have my wedding band, of course. Gotta have this on me every day. So that does it, that's my EDC. Feel free to drop in the comments below what you think or what you carry yourself. I'm always curious to see what other people carry. A lot of times I'll learn from other folks and kind of incorporate some of the things they have in their own daily carry into my own. And if you're into fountain pens, EDC, journaling, go ahead and subscribe. We're gonna be putting out a lot more content like this in the future. Thanks and talk to you next time.